All right, so let's talk again, right? Communication is two ways, right? It's not a one-way street. <laughs> no. Now, when I meet a girl, if we have a one-night stand or we have sex, right? Right. <laughs> the girl has to let me. <laughs> and act like to the point of us doing something or not, right? She wants to be with me. If you're not wanting to be with me, but you're with me anyway, that's still your lying, right? To me, not me, right? Again, saying no to something is an option, right? <laughs> not doing it anyway and then using it as an excuse to do something else to me so I don't know exactly what happened, but three times in a row, <laughs> maybe, right? First time, it's kind of innocent, right? Second time, you should know better. Third time, you're out, right? <laughs> you did it all three times, right? Unless we're just arguing about it for an hour, which don't make sense, right? See, like I said, if I'm doing something wrong, then you can ban me from the store, right? If I'm not doing nothing wrong, you can't ban me from the store, right? It, under what circumstances do you have the right to refuse service? Here's how that works. No shirt, no shoes, no service, right? I've heard that before. <laughs> but if I'm a customer coming in to get my nails done, you have no reason to kick me out of the store yet. <laughs> Unless we have sex or something in the bathroom and then you can kick me out of the store. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, you can't. Did you? <laughs> See, that's where you're lying, not me, right? I know we did something over an hour, right? I told you why I'm getting, right? My time schedule didn't change just because we did something extra in the store, right? <laughs> Besides the nail job, too, right? <laughs> and that only takes 40 minutes. <laughs> 30 if you're good. <laughs> right. <laughs> so the whole point is, when I went into that store, you recognized me. The only reason I recognize you is Mary Bell in my dream, right? You look like the girl in my dream. You also look like Michelle Kwan, who's around your age, and you can be the spitting image of her, in my opinion. <laughs> but again, I don't think you are Michelle Kwan. <laughs> and don't know her either, right? <clears throat> Nor do I expect to mess with her, right? She's not even doing anything in the skating world anymore anyway, right? Not because of me, right? I'm in Georgia, right? Never left Georgia for any start, right? <laughs> Anyone. <laughs> and if someone's conceited, narcissistic, <laughs> that I'm not going to the beach like everyone else... <laughs> And only did it once, right? Anyway. I don't know. And also with Molly Z, of course, right? We went to the beach a little bit too, right? But not Molly. <laughs> I never wrote Molly at all, right? Only Molly. <laughs> Zoludek, whatever that means. <laughs> now that sounds like a made up name if ever I heard one but I don't know <laughs> I, <don't> know. <laughs> I can't prove it's not it sounds somewhat zoolish <laughs> like from uh, <laughs> Ghostbusters or something right but I don't know either right see like all people when I meet someone for the first time, I told you this before, I got to get to know you. That means asking you certain questions. How old are you? What's your name? Blah, 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 blah. What kind of education do you got? Where are you from? Right. 
If I remember what you said there, right? Even if you black me out, right? Or tried to cause me what's called temporary amnesia or partial amnesia, right? By <clears throat> whatever means you did, right? While I'm sitting in the chair trying to get my nails done, right? Mm-hmm. But confused as to what is actually going on, right? <clears throat> you're not confused what you're doing, <laughs> nor the women in the store, right? I am, right? My confusion isn't because I'm trying to do you wrong or make you do something wrong yourself, right? But if you not, right? Something I don't and you withhold it from me, right? This is what James talking about too, right? If you know something I don't, right? And you do something wrong with me, right? It's your sin, not mine. Right? I don't know. I don't know. Now, the only way that you can say ignorance of the law is no excuse for the law is if I'm not trying to follow the law. Mm-hmm. But the other person has to know the law, too, applies to her, too, equally. <laughs> What does that mean? Right. Well, if a 15-year-old can't work in the store until she's 16 and she's working in the store and lies about her age, right? How am I supposed to know she's lying about her age 15 or 37? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know you, <laughs> Michelle. I don't know Michelle from Chinatown. Right? I don't know my cousin Brian's wife named Michelle, right? I don't hang out with him, right? <laughs> I don't see Brian. I saw Dion just recently, but I ain't seen him in a while either, right? I seen Bubba two years ago, right? That was the last time I saw him. And sometimes I see my cousin Pant, right? Think about an autobiography as all the dirt comes out of the laundry, right? <laughs> no, good man, good man. See, if I'm around it, I know not to do it, but that don't mean you don't think I don't know to do it. Right. See, if you think I would do it with you, it don't matter if I tell you no. I don't want to do it, does it? No. Why? I don't, you won't listen. <laughs> you done made up your mind. <laughs> See, once you make up your mind something is about you and it's not, right? I can no longer reason with you, right? No one can, not even Jesus or God, right? Some people go on what's called a tangent, even if they're wrong, right? And when you're doing that, until you die, right? (laughs) Or something stops you, like, say, you go and shoot people, right? For real, and I don't even own a gun, right? <clears throat> what you're doing is called vigilante behavior, right? You're thinking something's about you when it's not. It's just general knowledge, right? See, when I say 15 cannot work in the store, I'm not talking to someone who's specifically 15 and working in the store, right? That I know is working in the store, right? I don't know that, right? I don't know any 15 year olds working at the store, right? Or not, or not. Now, if me and the waitresses in the buffet mm, were to do something, they would, A, have to make the first move. We go somewhere secluded, like, say, one of the bathrooms, hypothetically, right? Still, still. And then me sit back down and be blacked out <laughs> with them, too, right? After (laughs) we get back, right? And I go back to eating, right? But when I came in and ordered the food, why could I remember that part of it? (laughs) If I'm here like the Wolverine, right? Or not, I don't know, but I am. (laughs) Well, the part of eating the food ain't the problem, right? It's not incorrect, right? It's not nothing wrong with it. 
Now Jesus talks of blotting out your sins and remembering them no more. The other angel, it must be him, is saying he'll never forget your sins. <laughs> I will remember them forever, right? That's the problem. When you got two equal but opposite opposing forces, you're going to create all kind of mayhem, right? Especially from that opposing force, right? When you're following it, it makes itself seem like it's a good idea, right? That's the biggest problem with the devil. <laughs> he makes his bad idea seem like a good idea, but you do it with him anyway, but then you're all caught in the same boat, right? We're all wrong, right? There's none that doeth good, no, not one, right? <laughs> we don't know what is truly good from evil anymore, right? None of us do, right? We all can lie, or we all can tell the truth, right? That's the problem. Mm -hmm. And your perspective of what is right and wrong is yours. Exactly, right? That's why you can't tell a gay person they can't be gay. Mm -hmm. If they don't admit, they gay. <laughs> they gay until they die. Mm -hmm. And even if they go to hell, <laughs> when they die, <laughs> it ain't your business. Right? Now, what's the problem there? The Bible talks of Sodom and the two angels being accosted by the men to know them, right? And they don't mean playing patty cake, right? They don't mean to find out what kind of life they lived or where they're from, right? The know there is yada again, right? It goes beyond, right? Simply friendship or meeting someone for the first time, right? These people were trying to rape the angels in the streets is what it means, right? That's the sin, right? Raping a stranger, right? Now, some say that has to do with hospitality, and it does, right? If I'm a stranger and I'm coming to your town and you only want sex with me, right? And say it's a male and female angel, too, right? And there are female angels in the Bible, <laughs> especially with who? What's his name? Ezekiel. Ezekiel. <laughs> And one of them has wings like a stork. Is that why you say the stork <laughs> brought your baby? <laughs> but you're again <laughs> confusing the angel with the act of sex and reproduction, right? As with what happened in Eden. Mm -hmm. Now, if you take the story seriously, none of it makes sense, right? In the first place, right? Unless it's what Adam and Eve said happened themselves, right? And they're still hiding some of the details, right? Now, if you're hiding some of the details, the story still won't make sense, right? How did Eve, who was made after Adam named the animals, know which tree to tell the serpent she wasn't supposed to eat of, right? Who's her go-between? Adam. Adam. Who told her the commandment, right? Adam, Adam. <laughs> Who told her? Uh huh. <laughs> Do not eat of the tree in the middle of the garden, nor touch it, lest she die. Mm -hmm. Adam? Adam. <laughs> Who added to the commandment of God his own commandment? Adam, Adam. <laughs> now, how do you know, right? The story goes from one point to naming the animals. Then, after seeing all the animals God made and naming them, right? Eve is made from Adam's rib and flesh, right? Not rib only, not the bone only. <laughs> flesh, too. <laughs> That's another part you're cutting out the story, right? When you cut that out the story, you're changing Adam, right? Into one of us, you know? When if Eve was in him, he, she wouldn't be manifested fully until she's out of him. 
You understand? All right. If the male and female are one in Christ Jesus' body, which is what they're talking about, we're all in the body of Christ and all means all, right? <laughs> That's why John sees paps <laughs> on the cross when Jesus is up on the cross, right? Now, what the Gnostics are talking about is the laughing Messiah that he let someone take his place on the cross, right? Sarcasm, right? The reason is, if you make him from androgynous to male, you're replacing the real image of God, right? <laughs> with the wrong image, right? Just like with Eve being taken out of Adam, right? By bone and flesh, you're fine with the rib, that don't bother you. You can't imagine, though, what the flesh was, right? <laughs> I know, I've seen a hermaphrodite, have you? <laughs> Unfortunately, they're only in porno, but I look at it for educational purposes, right? <laughs> Not to see the hermaphrodites having sex, so that's what it's about. Mm -hmm. But I've seen it before, and I had sex before myself, right? See, condemnation means this. If I do the same thing as you, right? Even if I'm married after the fall, and we're all sinners after the fall. Mm -hmm. Marrying and being given in marriage means what? You don't know who you're really supposed to marry. Right. <laughs> Simple as that, right? And what you're doing is you're saying, oh, we're male and female. We think we love each other. So let's get married, right? Nothing wrong with that, right? If you forgive it, right? <laughs> but if you condemn it, <laughs> right? And other people who marry are people who have orgies or people do this or do that, right? That ain't your business either. <laughs> None's it your business. Nothing someone else does consensually is your business, right? Now, if you get paid for it or not, that's between you right, and the actors you're working with. right? If Halle Berry and Billy Bob had sex, we don't know because of the angle of the camera. Right? Which is focused on, on her being on top of him in front, right? you know, shot, right? You can't say 100% they are, and you can't say 100% they aren't. And discretion means it's a movie, so I don't no, right. I ain't worried about it, right? <laughs> now, if they did, only two people know if they did. Billy Bob and Hatley, right? <laughs> it still ain't none of your business, right? <laughs> to even worry about it, right? <clears throat> Do you understand, right? Why it ain't none of your business, right? If they really had sex or not, right? Both were married at the time. He, him to Angelina Jolie and her to some uh, rock star musician type. I forgot his name. Right. right. Him you don't remember. Holly you'll always remember. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> of course, of course. <laughs> now, I know better right, than to even mess with Holly Berry. Right? I also know better to mess with a 15-year-old working in her dad's lawn illegally. Right? I'm not going out there to mess with you because you're working in your dad's store to get you in trouble. Mm -hmm. But if you think I did, or thought I did, right? Or someone told you I did, or you told yourself I did, right? Who, how do you even know about me? <laughs> in the first place, right? You don't, I don't <laughs> know about you in the first place. <laughs> Now, same with Caitlin or Megan or whoever, right? <laughs> I meet mean, at the theater, right? There's only one place we can have sex if we lock the door, and that's again in the bathroom, and that's privacy, right? Once you're in the bathroom, even in the family room, right, which allows males or females, right? <laughs> and I'm disabled, so it's easier for me to go there and then into the bathroom with everybody else. Why can I legally use it right, if I have a bad back and ankle, right, and can barely make it to the other bathroom, right, and I'm hurting, right, even if it's called the family room, right? Hmm. <laughs> you see what I mean, right? But when I go in there, unless I lose time, like at the salon, which I didn't, and I don't report that normally, right, except with the salon when it happened, nor did it happen the second time I went out. 
Nor did it happen the third time when I was finally banned from it, right? See? Mm hmm Thought I went into the bathroom the third time, right? <laughs> Guess what I mean? Mm -hmm. I'm trying to show you different things I am, right? In the bedroom, too, or the bathroom. <laughs> and I had sex with my girlfriend in the shower, right? And I saw a couple in the movie had sex in the bathroom in the restaurant, right? See, am I feeding myself these ideas, or did I see it in the movie first, right? A movie first, right? Now, fantasy versus reality means a female of a certain age, like with the two characters in the movie, has to say yes or no to the scene, right? If you say yes, you're consenting, right? If you say no, you're not consenting, right? And I have to back off, right? If I know all that, right, and you don't, right? Or you don't do that. Or you lie about your age. I don't know you're lying about your age yet. Right. I'm not trying to do nothing wrong. But you can lie to me too. Right. And something can happen that I didn't plan on happening. Right. And that's all I really am saying about it. Right. So neither one of us gets in trouble. Mm -hmm. Whoever this person is on YouTube. They're trying to get us both in trouble. All right. <laughs> are all in trouble. What they also don't realize is you can't set a minor up with me either, right? In other words, you can't tell the minor I want sex with her and talk her into it, right? <laughs> to get me in trouble. Mm -hmm. And you and her know her age, but I don't, right? <laughs> See, then I'm telling you I'm not trying to be with her. I'm not trying to be with her. And she's just even working on her dad's door. I don't know which one you're talking about anyway. Anyway. There are a bunch of nail salons in Georgia, right? Around Effingham, Savannah, <laughs> they're all over the place, right? That's a big business in Georgia, right? Mm -hmm. And I told you I've been going out to a few before I went out to your store as well, so you're making it about you, right? I'm not, right? Making it about you. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> People laugh when they keep trying to tell you something and you won't listen and they know they're making sense, but you still won't listen, right? That's your denial, then, right? That's you trying to get me in trouble because you think getting me in trouble is worse for me, right? Than for you, right? <laughs> No, I think it was worse for you than for me. <laughs> and you don't want to admit that either, right? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> now, day by day, week by week, hour by hour, minute by minute, right? Month by month, after that, right? <laughs> year by year, right? I've been dealing with some idiots on YouTube, right? who don't understand what I'm saying, right? They're trying to pretend I'm confessing something I never said I did, right? <laughs> or was in a position to do, right? Or that my ex-wife or the daughter ever said I did, right? Unless the daughter thinks the mother let it happen anyway and wanted revenge or something, right? And I still don't know if she got revenge on her or not, <laughs> Which is the whole point, too, right? But I do know weird things are happening to the TV or something, right? That I didn't do. But I don't know it's her or who's doing it, right? <laughs> mm hmm <laughs> And the other way is, again, that can happen is if someone's blocking me out after the girl comes by, right? She can get in the door. You can't if you're a guy. Mm -hmm. Certain people can't get in at night. My mom can't come over at night. There's no reason to, right? My stepdad, right? Can't come over at night. There's no reason to, right? My sister, either one, I got two, right? Can't come over to my house, right? In the middle of the night because I don't expect them to. <laughs> I would try to talk to them, of course, right? And not be rude or anything, <laughs> But 
it depends on what's going on, right? You know what I mean, right? Normally, though, that don't happen, right? But I do talk to her on the phone. I do go over to her house. If they want to help me clean the house, they've been over to my house a few times, right? That's normal, right? What's not normal is you getting all up in my business saying you don't worry, care about this every time I post, right? Something, right? That don't mean you don't care, right? That means you're worried the story is becoming popular, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't know it is. I don't even know it is. <laughs> I'm just trying to tell the truth of what I remember happening or not, right? To the best of my knowledge and memory, right? And ability, right? Even if I was co-graded by my shipmates and don't remember it. <laughs> I'm not saying they did, but I don't remember they did, but I don't mean they didn't. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Especially if I survived the record with these three calls, right? Huh, huh. And probably told them that, too, and that God would see me through their attack, right? If they were to try to co-read me, right? Well, I don't know what they did until a few good men. <laughs> <clears throat> you can't handle the truth. I know you can't. <laughs> Can you? No. no. Mm-hmm. Even if Frederica tricked me and has having sex with other men, right? I don't know, right? But I wanted some of that too, <laughs> right? <laughs> so I'm not judging it, right? <laughs> either, either. I did like her, though, and told her I was looking for a girlfriend, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I did ask her age, right? I know. She gave me a birthday, even, right? <laughs> of 1984, right? So that means she's old enough, right? If you tell me you're 37, I'm going to believe you, right? You're telling me you're old enough, right? If you don't tell me you're 37, and you tell me you're working in your dad's store to make a little money, <laughs> instead, I would understand that and let you do that, right? See, I'm not trying to be a butt wipe, but, yeah, legally, right? You're not supposed to work into the store until you're 16, right? Really at all, really at all. It's not you that'll get in trouble, it's your dad, by the way. <laughs> All right. He ain't supposed to do that with you either, even if you're begging him to work in it. Acting like you can handle it all, right? When if I was blacked out, you can't handle it all. <laughs> I could handle it all but you. You could handle it all but me, right? <laughs> and see, that means again, right? Blackmail. <laughs> it's because you again knew you were 15, but I didn't, right? <laughs> But it's like, whatever happened with the Comcast girl, right? I don't remember details, right? But I know there's someone coming, right? I don't know if it's a male or female technician, but I know when I'm in the back room, right? And I'm already trying to get dressed, right? If she suddenly is there and pulls into the... Mm-hmm, either the carport or mm-hmm, parts, right? next to the house, right? <laughs> the address she's looking for is 40 Nova Jones Court, right? Blah, 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 right? <laughs> mm-hmm. She's got my, again, information, right? <laughs> With Comcast, right? She's got my email, my phone numbers, right, right? All that, too. All that, too. So she still knows more about me than I know about her. Mm-hmm. But now, again, when she comes in, that's where I'm not sure what happened over 20 minutes, right? <laughs> but I too know that's enough for me to either have sex with her, but she also can't leave the property until after 15 minutes of waiting, right? And that's where the confusion comes in as the wild's blacked out at all, right? So, here's the only two theories I can come up with, right? From their own, right? And I say, it's a theory. I'm making it up, right? 
That means I'm not lying intentionally. I don't remember what I'll happen, right? So if like with Michelle, mm -hmm. I got a little confused, right? I could have let her in, right? And be naked behind the door. Mm -hmm. Partially still, right? Because I got confused last day and I thought she just wanted to come on in and then I could put on my shorts, right? And I was just going to go ahead and let her on in and I wasn't thinking straight, maybe, right? And let her come in. Well, the next thing she knows, she's in the house, right? And the house ain't immaculate. I don't think I had the drums yet <laughs> or all that either, but still, still. Mm -hmm. I think that was in... 21, too, right? Around April. Mm hmm. Right. When she did, right? But again, I would then start explaining what was going on, why I got confused, blah, 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 that I'm in the yield, blah, 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 right? So I think I was back out in 2019, right? And tell her all that, right? <laughs> I know, right, some of what. I might would say, right? But not everything, right? I said, right? I don't know. Because, of course, suddenly she's in the house with me half-dressed, maybe, right? And then, of course, I close the door, right? So she's kind of trapped, right? Whether intentionally or unintentionally on my part, right? Too, too. But then I would start immediately once... If she had the shot there, right? Mm hmm Start explaining, right? Immediately, right? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but still, I don't remember what happened, so something must have happened, right? More and more. Because I'm coming to 20 minutes later, right? Now, the worst case scenario is, again... She bought the story. We had sex in my bedroom or something, right? She picked up one of the six and knocked me out, right? And that's enough. After I told her, she could say yes or no, right? After I told her, right, how I beat love to her a little bit, right? <laughs> well, has it been a long time now? Right, about 20 minutes, Hmm. <laughs> now I'm telling both stories, all three stories, all the stories, right, rolled into one. Even the stepdaughter I brought up again, right? Because I'm on the couch. <laughs> See, there's something not thinking into your brain, right, that don't make sense, right? That changes the story, right? <laughs> From it being... My fault to my ex wife's fault, too, right? See, if I'm on the couch, right, I'm where I'm supposed to be, right? If the daughter comes in there and wakes me up, who's not where they're supposed to be? The child, right? Now, I'm not saying I did nothing with it, right? Even if she did, you are, you are. All I'm telling you I would do is as soon as I realize it, I'm going to bring her back to her mom, right? Anything more than that, and you're making me embellish it, right? <laughs> And Daphne knows if I'm embellishing it, not you. <laughs> but I'm not trying to get into her pants, right? Now. <laughs> or then, or then. If she did, right? I can't do nothing about it, nor can you, right? If she really did, right? But she's not supposed to, right? But if she's only four and say she's waking up people in her own grandma's house, right? Who's fall asleep on, say, Thanksgiving or Christmas or the holidays or something, right? And she was kind of in the habit of that. She could have thought, hey, he's sleeping on the couch. Maybe I should wake him up or something. And I don't know. <laughs> See, then I'm having to put words in her mouth as you're trying to put words in my mouth, right? See, I don't know what a four-year-old would be thinking <laughs> if she came in there to me or not. But I do know, right? The four reasons a child wakes you up or nothing to do with sex, right? But could be construed, the last two, as sexual. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and that's what? 
pee or I need a bath or shower. Mm -hmm. Right, right. <laughs> and then you gotta smell the child. <laughs> <laughs> Those are the only two things that can get weird, right? Because of what? Of the, I don't know what's going on with her. Mm -hmm. I still don't know why she's in the living room with me if she is, right? Or what I should do with her. Mm -hmm. Now, mm -hmm. it's not that I'm not going to bring her back to her mom either. <laughs> I know to do that eventually too, right? Depending on why I think she's in there, right? Now, say you wake up and she's right there with her crotch in your face. Would you think she has to pee? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> right. Could that be a possibility? Right. Or if she's by the bathroom, she's kind of staring at you, right? Either she's afraid to turn on the light herself, or I don't know, right? But the light was on, I think, right? Or off in the living room right now. <laughs> now, if I left the light on, there's a reason for that, right? So both her or my ex-wife could go to the bathroom and see where they're going, right? But she don't know how to turn on the light in four. <laughs> see what I mean, right? A four-year-old can't turn on the bathroom light by herself, right? She would need my help? No, no. <laughs> so the story also proves I'm sleeping on the couch, right? That's all I'm confessing to you. <laughs> Not that I'm a listener. <laughs> You're saying, even though I said I did not molest her, that I'm a listener anyway, right? No. I never said that. <laughs> I never admitted to that. <laughs> even in a dream state, I never admitted to that. <laughs> Even if I'd said I masturbated in the dream, I never admitted to that, right? Because you can't control the dream, right? But my pastor mm -hmm, was trying to masturbate with certain men, single men, within his church, right? Now, is that right or wrong? <laughs> Ask the Catholics. <laughs> right. Again, right? Can a pastor of a church <laughs> and think about this Christian Fellowship Church is this what your pastor is teaching you Jesus wants you to do with him <laughs> and he's not a cult leader I know he's not <laughs> I know he's not <laughs> either either it's not about sex but Jesus right I know but if you want to masturbate with you, is it about sex? Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thus, men aren't taught to do that with another man. <laughs> Even gay men, unless they're in prostitution part of it, <laughs> don't normally jerk each other off. <laughs> do you? <laughs> Never. <laughs> with your pastors. <laughs> and have the pastor have you lie about it, right? Or blackmail you into it by trying to pat your butt <laughs> and trying to get you to hit him, right? So you can't do you better than that. <laughs> he knows rape is about power. Molestation is about power. Mm -hmm. I never had any power. <laughs> Not even with you in the swamp, Michelle. You had all the power. Mm -hmm. I didn't even know your age, right? That's why I asked, right? Nor Frederica's, nor Tina's, right? But Tina's kind of tall, right? <laughs> mm -hmm. For an Asian girl, right? And either one of them, all three of you can be my dream girl. Mm -hmm. But I'm not trying to be with you all. Mm -hmm. I just don't know it. <laughs> If I'm with more than one, right? Or all three of you even, right? <laughs> and see, again, you're seducing me into the bathroom while I'm trying to eat my food, right? Which means I'll leave the food and then go have sex with you and go sit back to eat the food. And that's when I'm blacked out, I guess, right? 
because I just don't want going back to eating the food, right? <laughs> and only eat the food at the restaurant I ordered, right? I don't know nothing else happened, right? I'm not trying to accuse Tina or Frederica either, right? Hmm. But I wouldn't mind. <laughs> there either, there either, right? But I'm not the trickster there. Mm -hmm. It would then be Frederica and the people in the store, right? Who would then, after me and Frederica got out of the bathroom, try to shoot me in the head and then <laughs> go back in the... And then I hear, like, the Wolverine and go back to eating food, right? And that's why I don't remember it. <laughs> Doesn't that sound very made up? <laughs> right. Whether it happened or not, right? Some stories, right? I don't know. Even hypothetical ones, as long as you say they're hypothetical, aren't any different than what you see in the movies, right? That I make up anyway, right? I tell you that too, right? That's because in my reality, you had all that happening, right? Right. Too, too. Mm hmm. So if I tell you that and you take advantage of that, am I taking advantage of you or you me, right? Even if I'm 52 <laughs> and you're 15 or lying about your age, right? <sighs> I don't know you're lying about your age. <laughs> and you're not supposed to seduce your customer and black him out at the same time, right? Why? All right. <laughs> mm -hmm. One changes it to a felony, right? <laughs> For one. For one. You're committing the felony, right? By shooting, right? It's not manslaughter if it's premeditated, by the way. Mm -hmm. It's murder, right? You're setting me up to have sex with you, and without the sex, there is no crime, right? <laughs> no. So if you black me out all three times, I know it involves sex because it's over 20 minutes each time, right? Because I realized I lost an hour in addition to the nails being done, right? And I remember the nail part, but not the blackout part or when she blacked me out. <laughs> but I do know I lost over an hour, right? Up to an hour and 10 minutes, including... The nail job, right? I know with Mary Bell, though, mm -hmm, I had sex with her up to that amount of time, right? Not her, not her, not Michelle, not Michelle. Mm -hmm. Now, anyone involved with this who's an adult right, and talked Michelle into it, guess what you did? <laughs> you entrapped me, both you and her, right? What's the difference between entrapment, again, right, and someone trying to sleep with a 15-year-old, right? The person who wants to sleep with a 15-year-old wouldn't let ask her her age, right? <laughs> Ain't this hilarious? Ooh, cute girl, Jenny, right? <laughs> or Jim. Right. <laughs> But she looks like the girl in the dream, too. Right? But she's on Wheel of Fortune. Right? Unless you contact her yourself and tell her I'm interested in her, she won't know me. She don't know me. Right? <laughs> Even if she looks like the girl in the dream more than you did, right? Let's say. <laughs> but I just see the pretty Asian girl, right? <laughs> I don't go after the Persian Asian, pretty Asian girl. Even if I get a nudie magazine with Asian girls in it. <laughs> like, um, the Japanese girl in the Playboy, right? What's her name? <laughs> it starts with an H, right? <laughs> but that means <laughs> I got the magazine, right? In the Drawer still. They're still missing Miss Kardashian's one from that year. <laughs> but I'm not knowing how it got out the house, right? Even with Miss Kardashian's issue, right? 
But it's not a crime to have it, Kim. <laughs> if it's not about you, right? If it's not about you. <laughs> or Courtney, or... Right? <laughs> Mm -hmm. Any of your sisters, right? <laughs> and without Rob, you mean, right? Chris had a boy, right? <laughs> I know. Mm -hmm. And like I said, I don't know none of you, right? Though I'm not abnormal, right? Just because I had a bad experience with the military, right? And fell three stories, right? I'm still seen normal to me, right? Before I joined and after, right? I took up a little karate, but I'm not the only one to do that, right? You can't say that either, right? <laughs> and all that's from my past, right? Right, right. Has nothing to do with you still, right? I took karate before I met you, right? And I remained interested in karate before I met you. And even now, I'm still interested in martial arts after I met you. Because <laughs> I'm still me, right? Even if you black me out, <laughs> like I hear like the Wolverine, I just don't remember all the details, right? And I'm saying that to both protect us both if you were 15. Right? So no one knows specifically what we did or didn't do, too, right? But I know the time is an hour <laughs> with 40 minutes to do the nails, right? And again, right, I was only in the store the whole time, right? Unless we went to a motel room, which that would be weird. I don't know an hourly rated motel room, right? Like in New York <laughs> or SVU, right? They have hourly motel rooms there, <laughs> but not in Georgia. <laughs> but like I said, right, when you see something in a dream, right, and you convey it to someone, right, who's taking advantage of that dream? Mary Bell? Yeah, yeah. Did she? No, no. I don't know her, right? <laughs> I've never met her. That's the first time I've seen her. Today, mm -hmm. and never seen her before. Right? Now, if she showed up at the door, mm -hmm. not on the door, mm -hmm. and I started asking who she was and trying to figure out what was going on, and then we had sex, and then she left. Right? Is that legal? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Why is that legal? The Bible says you can do that too. Right? <laughs> if she's what? Unbetrothed, unbetrothed, right? Now, I don't know nothing still because I missed the part where she's talking about herself, right? Now, if she's married and shows up, do I know that? No, no. <laughs> if we still have sex, am I committing adultery or is she? She is, she is, right? He that knoweth it do good, right? And do it not <laughs> to him in the sin, right? But he that is faithful, right? And trying to make love to a single woman, right? That's not a thing, right? Why? Moses allows for it. Moses allows for it. Right? If I think she's single, right? I don't know she's married or not, right? Do I have to ask her if she's at my house? No. No. <laughs> That's the point, right? If you're married, you're committing adultery if you know you're married, right? But I don't judge you, right? If you're at my house, what's going on? You're having a problem. <laughs> you're having a problem with your husband, right? So this is still hypothetical, though, right? Even though she looks like my dream girl, right? <laughs> I'm making it up because I don't know it happened, right? At all, at all. <laughs> but she's another example of someone who looks like the girl in my dream who I may never meet, right? But local girls who look like the girl in my dream, I have to be careful with, right? <laughs> they don't know that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I know they do. You know they do. My audience knows they do, whatever that is, right? But no one else. 
Right. <laughs> so there you have it again, right? Who's the culprit? Who's the problem? Who's the solution? Right? We're all making mistakes, right? Even if I slept with a 15 year old thinking she was 37, right? In the bathroom, right? Hypothetically, right? To lose the hour of time in the sort, right? In addition to the nails that I have to see Arctic does instead of Terminator, Dark Feet, or Harriet. <laughs> now, who would interfere with me seeing Harriet? Thomas Barbie? <laughs> Which is the plan, right? With or without the nail job, right? <laughs> so that's the point, though. Mm -hmm. And until I got to the mm -hmm, actual, mm -hmm. and see, I parked there, right, in the handicap still, right, and planned to walk over to the theater, right. Why? Well, I was getting my nails done first, right. And the theater ain't that far, and if you get there a little after two, right. You should be out before the movie starts and it should be 10 to 3, right? But I'm not out to 10 to 4. Mm. And it's not daylight saving time until Sunday evening <laughs> or Saturday evening, right? And then Sunday morning is daylight savings, right? You just want to try and pull that, right? Now by January, right? When someone called the police on me about going into the store and having to use the bathroom <laughs> from Walmart, right? Then I was walking, right? Then I was having to get around by taxi or whatever, right? Or cat bus, right? <laughs> and again, having to walk <laughs> to the theater, right? And on the way there, the salon was still open, so it was before six, right? that I got to the movie theater and got the movie, right? Though the ticket was still an hour behind, right? But the officer also knew I was in line, right? With whoever called the police on me, right? And I asked him about, you know, debt slavery or working someone too underage, right? I know. <laughs> but he also told me I'm banned from the store not to go out anymore and I ain't been out since, right? So why do you still harass me about it when I did what you asked me to do, right? You're harassing me. <laughs> not me, you. <laughs> Even if you don't want me talking about it anymore. You cannot control my mouth, nor me yours, right? That's called freedom of speech, right? As long as I'm telling you I'm making up part of the story, right? It's not a crime to do that either, right? Even if it's sexual. Mm -hmm. Even if you lied about your age, right? Even if we had sex, for real. Mm -hmm. You're lying. <laughs> not me, not her, not someone else, right? And I'm fine by myself, too. Right. I don't have to have a wife. Right. Until I find someone who can handle all this. Right. Now, if you don't think I can, that's your opinion. Right. And you're welcome to it. Right. And that's fine. Right. But when I tell you something, right, you cannot come here. Right. Get the magazine, right? If you're Kim Kardashian, have sex with me to seduce me, right? Leave me, right? With the magazine, right? And act like that's not wrong either, right? <laughs> it is, it is. If you did, if you were to. Now, I don't know that, right? I don't know what happened to the magazine, right? I just, again, know it's missing, right? Of my collection of Playboy for that year, right? Which, that's Kim's fault because it's missing? I don't think so. I don't think so. Or Kanye, either, right? Did someone just steal it or just turn it missing? I don't know, right? 
Did I accidentally throw it in the trash? Maybe. I don't know. Right. Did someone take it while I was moving in? I don't know. Right. <laughs> like Mark or whoever, right, helped me to move. Right. But again, right. See. see. And I paid them and I paid them and I got here and I've been here since, right? Almost 10 years, right? And I'm trying to stay out of trouble. <laughs> you can't get me in trouble hmm, if you're underage and doing something illegal yourself, right? See, that's what the pastor was doing with his congregation, by the way. Mm -hmm. And see, if I'm exposed to that, I know better than to do that even to the pastor in this little unit ship program didn't, right? And they're not going to talk me into it, right? I will just say politely, no things. Right? No, I mean, no, I mean, if you want to do it, you do it. <laughs> but I was taught not to do it, so I don't feel comfortable doing it, so I'm not going to do it. Simple as that, right? If you, again... Want to do something with your pastor, right? And you're in agreement with it by faith, right? It's not a sin to you too, right? But here's your problem. Paul also said, let not your good be evil spoken of. <laughs> now, if you tell people <laughs> you're a pastor and you're masturbating with your single men, right? Do you think that would be received well or bad? <laughs> Durr. Durr. <laughs> Badly, right? And the pastor ain't going to tell you this. He ain't going to confess this to you. He didn't confess it to 2020. But you know they're there for some reason. I'm telling you what he was telling me, right? First thing he said is it's okay to masturbate, which I already knew that, right? I read the Bible before. <laughs> I know what Moses says about it. If you're by yourself and your seed happens to come out <laughs> magically or manually, <laughs> don't come out any other way, brother. <laughs> and it gets on anything, including your skin or garment. <laughs> Your naked skin or I mean, <laughs> even if you're naked, right? Wash anything it gets on, and you're unclean to evening. Does that sound like Moses is saying it's okay or not okay? Okay. As long as it's not, you know, <laughs> with another man, <laughs> not right, with your wife, right? I don't know. He doesn't take it with your wife either, but. <laughs> right. but definitely not two men, or even if it led to sex or not, you're not to lie with the man as a woman, right? Or a woman as a man, right? <clears throat> that too goes in the gay sex for men or women, too, right? Paul mentions it in Romans, right? But I guess they don't think he means it or he's being judgmental, which he is, which he is. See, that's the problem, too. What do you do then if Jesus says, forgive me, forgive it? Right. Even gay people have to be forgiven their sins. And straight people, right? Because <laughs> you don't know who you're supposed to marry either. I keep telling you that. You can get pregnant by someone and not be legally married to them, right? And still have to have the baby, right? And I, even though I got you pregnant, right, but you still got to do something with the baby. You either got to put him up for adoption, raising, or put him in foster care, right? That's your three choices, right? And, uh, and I didn't know, I didn't think, I didn't plan on it, right? But I know I lost the hour in the store, right? So what happens? What happened? I keep asking, what did we do? What did we do? Why did you lie to me then, right? You didn't tell me 15 going in, right? You didn't try to work it out with me even if you were 15, right? You told me 37, right? So in the first place, I'm not trying to sleep with you just because you're 15 and working on the shore. <laughs> never was, never was. Who told you that 
I was trying to have sex with you. Because <laughs> you look like the girl in my dream, right? Third time's a charm. <laughs> she got $22,360, right? I guess she's winning. I guess she's winning. <laughs> she's winning. See, I'm the kind of person who likes singing or getting along with people or is trying to be life a party or positive all the time, right? My shipmates weren't positive all the time. <laughs> I know. And I know it's driving me bad here. Because <laughs> I know what they're doing is going to get us all in trouble in the end, right? Especially them more than me, right? Right. Mm -hmm. <sighs> well, it's the, about the end, right? It's about 721, right? And it's a new programming, the Villa Fortune on WSAV, right? From 7 to 730, and it's only got nine minutes left, right? So unless someone does something big, it looks like 